I was today years old when I learned that there's a type of ant, a queen ant, that goes into other ant colonies, sprays the queen in that colony with a certain scent that gets her own worker ants to kill the queen, and then that queen that came in and invaded takes over the whole colony. They're parasitic ant queens. The way they do it is wild. First, they rub up against a worker ant outside the colony and use that scent of the worker ant as a disguise. So then when the parasitic ant goes into the new colony, the ants aren't as, con they're not as scared because they're like, oh, this is one of us. And then the queen ant, the parasitic queen ant, goes and sprays the other queen getting everyone to turn against it. So the reason this works is because the parasitic ant and the host ant are part of the same genus. So they both have the same defensive spray that the parasitic ant uses as a weapon against the host ant. And the photos of this are pretty nuts. You can see here on the left-hand side, there is the parasite ant, which has already sprayed the host ant and the host ants, worker ants are attacking it. And I really wanted to understand why has this evolutionary behavior basically evolved. And the reason is because for the parasite ant, going and setting up her own colony is risky. Other animals could disturb it. It's hard to set up something like that. For her, it's a lot easier evolutionarily to take over another existing colony. And the parasitic queen doesn't even need to subject herself to harm because she's getting the worker ants to kill the host ant. And so it's actually a really elegant for lack of a better word, solution, evolutionarily, so evolutionary solution for the parasitic ant. Anyway, I thought the story was fascinating and is a wild example of how defenses in nature can be turned into weaknesses. I found this on Particle News, which breaks down news stories into these easy to read digests and allows you to ask questions about them, see relevant quotes, photos, and see a bunch of different articles from different news sources that have been written about them. It's a really cool app, so check it out if you're looking for a refreshing way to get the news. Peace and have a great day.